novation, renewal. Is it odd or oxymoronic somewhat to think that sometimes novation is a result of doing what was painfully obvious? But oftentimes that painfully obvious is something that we don't actually do because of procrastination or because we just keep putting it to the side, putting it off for whatever reason. And when you do get back on your feet and get back on the right track, then you you see the results that any idiot could have told you would have happened. And then you're just left gobsmacked. Wow. Human beings really are peculiar creatures, aren't they? Creatures always seeking pleasure, always trying to avoid pain. It's amazing how those, those two, shall we say, factors or those two elements always guide us and always help us chart our course. And I'm not sure if help is even the correct word, but it's often our first recourse, our first two tools that we go to instantly, or the ones that I guess most humans are just prone to using because they haven't been taught or they haven't taught themselves rather how to use anything else. I just sit here today musing about the fact that, you know, it is really amazing how maybe before the last musing, let's say the day or a couple of days before, my mind was, I guess, mental state was in shambles. Yet, with a little perspective shift, listening to some of my old musings and then coming up with a new musing, going on with the course, begin to see things from a new light, a new perspective, and when I come back to this little place I call home, I'm reminded that even though I have an 8 to 5, it's not the end all be all, there's larger purpose to my life. There is something else. And it's in these little small acts that you keep reminding yourself. فَذَكِّرْ فَإِنَّ الْذِكْرَى تَنْفَعُ الْمُؤْمِنِينَ And remind, for the reminder is beneficial for the believer. In a previous life, I used that or took it to mean something else, which pushed me to one course of action. I am no longer walking that path, but who says I can't take inspiration from wherever I see it? Wisdom is the lost property of the believer. Novation. Repeating it seems to almost open up my brain and show me new pathways, light up new and create new neural links within. Bliss, serenity. Are all these the results of novation? Because novation, I'm no linguist, but from my limited understanding, it doesn't actually imply completely uncharted territory, but rather it implies a renewal of something old. Meaning that the highs that you do experience, the good that you do experience, they are all familiar to you. And perhaps that's why it feels doubly sweet, or it feels better than it would have the first time, at least to some extent, because you are expectant of it. I don't know how much this expectancy will factor in to the actual enjoyment, and if one day it will just give way to a sort of redundancy. But I can only speak from where I am right now in this path. And truly, 
Hmm. I have to walk until the end of this path before I can really rev this icebreaker up and <laughs> chart a new path altogether. It looks like on some days, yes, I'll still be on this icebreaker, but perhaps on some days you don't need to break the ice. Some days you just need a little bit of novation. Just a little something to rejuvenate everything that you've had working for you until now. And in so doing, you will reach the destination. You will reach the peak. I gotta run now. Because in this course of novation, there's a certain place I want to see. Until next time, Assalamu alaikum.